guys, it's Shannon, and today I'm here with part two of my lipstick try on haul from Miss Goss. So I will post, um, well, I'll leave a little i card right up here for um, the first video that I did probably about a week and a half, two weeks ago now, I think. So these are the six darker shades in the 12 set, I think it is. Um, there's six lighter, like, peachier, pinky, nudes, like, shades like that. And then there is the darker purple berries, shades like that. So, I do have a code for these. They are not paying me to talk about these. Um, I did get a discount to get them myself. And then I also got a discount code for you all for 20% off of your purchase. Um, so I will leave that code either on the screen now I'll probably forget to edit it. I'll probably upload this when I go to work. Like, I'll just automatically do it and not even think about it. Um, and if it's not there, it'll be in the description box down below. Um, but, yeah, be sure to check these out. I ordered them on Amazon. They're not super expensive. Hold on. Let me check. I have the page up here. Um, so, for six... I can't even speak. For six of them, you get them for $14.99. Um, and then there is Prime as well, and that doesn't include the 20% off, so you'll get however much off. I don't, I can't do math. Um, but yeah, let's just get started. Um, my hair's going to annoy me. Hold on, let me put it up, and I'll just talk about this. So I've been wearing the first set of these a lot recently. I really like them. My dog's going to start barking because some guy's here picking up my, um, um, my lawnmower because it doesn't work so he's taking it um to get it fixed so it's our friend it's not just a random stranger <laughs> but my dog's gonna be barking at him but yeah let's just get started so i'm gonna start with these go from seven to twelve so i guess i'll just start with seven um and go so just like the others the packaging is exactly the same it's got a cute little elephant on it and then this packaging is the same as well. And I'm going to do a swatch on my hand, and then I'll do the actual swatch on my lips. I need to bring my mirror over. I wasn't expecting myself to film this today, but I had some extra time before I had to go to work. So why not, right? So this is number seven. It's like a dark nude like a dark nudie pink and these are all mattes by the way I think I forgot to say that they're like um they describe it as a silky velvet matte and they're supposed to be waterproof as well I haven't tested the waterproof part though ignore how gross my lips look my lips are very dry I'm out of chow stick so I haven't used any in a while <laughs> That was horrible application, but this is the color. I really like this color. I think it's really nice for fall. It's really pretty, and this is it on the back of my hand. I think I showed you that. Um, yeah. So far, I really like this color. They're really comfortable on the lips. I don't find that they make my lips extra ch like chapped or anything, um, or dry my lips out a whole a whole bunch. Um, they're just very very comfortable. And to remove them, I'm using the Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. If I remember, I'll leave this linked below, too. It takes them off really easy. I have to go to work after this, so I'm trying not to, like, get this stuff all over my face. Because I don't need to go to work with lipstick all over my face, you know? I can already tell these are going to leave a stain. Be warned about that. I need to watch where I'm putting these because these are darker in color than the lighter ones. And I'm on a white tablecloth, so I don't need to stain that. That would not be good. My grandma would be very, very mad. 
All right. So number eight is getting into the reds. If you guys haven't watched my channel for a long time, um, red is probably my favorite lipstick color to wear. Like, I love it. This is the color. It's a really pretty berry red. I like it. I love this shade. This is like that classic red lipstick. I love it. Obsessed. <laughs> like, especially because I have winged eyeliner on right now, so it's like that classic kind of Marilyn red lip, winged liner, all that. Obsessed. And again, they remove so easily. Like, if you wear them all day, they stay all day, but when it's time to remove them, they come off like that which I love. I feel like these darker ones are going to stain a little bit though. Like the lighter ones don't stain, but I feel like these ones might. Which that's okay. Some darker lipsticks do stain sometimes, but... Okay, this is number nine. I wish these would have names instead of just numbers. Now we're getting into the berries. It's a berry pink. They're very, very easy to apply, as you can tell. That's number nine. Give me one second. All right, I'm back. Sorry, guys. Um, so, yeah, this is number nine that I have one now. So, hi, Angel. What are you doing? My dog is right here for me. What time is that? I need to be watching the time, too. Ah. Guys, I wait and do things last minute sometimes. Okay, it's only 3 o'clock. I don't have to leave for, like, 30 minutes. Oh god. Ruining everything. Do you guys ever just have those days where like you somehow manage to just ruin like anything and everything? Have me one of those days. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I just had this one on for like ten minutes and it's already like staining my lips. And that was the berry one, so. But, like I said, I don't personally mind that because I wear so many different lipsticks. It doesn't really matter to me. Alright, so this is number 10. It's another red. This is more of a classic red. Comparing it to the first red. There's a little bit of a difference, but not a huge amount. This one might be slightly darker. Oh, Snoop. My dog just like bit my foot under the table. Cause he's being a little jerk today. Okay, I would say this is more of like an orangey red rather than a blue red. Maybe. Am I looking at that right? Yeah. This is definitely, it has orange undertones. But I still really like it. I normally wear ones with blue undertones when I wear red. But I don't mind the um, oranges. What do you want, Angel? You can't wear lipstick. We just have two more. We're on number 11 now. Oh, these are the really dark ones. This is a dark purple. What? 
Bye, baby. I do notice this one is a little bit more patchy. Like, it doesn't come that way, across that way on camera as much. But definitely in person, it's very patchy. But once you kind of work on blending it some. Angel, no! Just trying to chew on my shoes. Um, but like in person, once you blend it out some, that patchiness kind of goes away. Going through so many cotton pads, oh my gosh. So last night, um, I was sick like all day yesterday. I had a stomach virus. And so I was just laying on the couch and grandma was out here. This is number 12. This one's super dark. And um, grandma and I were like browsing the movies because we were really bored. Very similar to that last one. Um, and I talked her into watching The Psycho, not explaining what it was. And I'd never seen it either. <laughs> she was horrified. It was really good though. I enjoyed it. I'm not a big fan on horror movies, so I don't know why I wanted to watch it. But the guy that plays um Norman is definitely my new celebrity crush. What's his name? Anthony Perkins, I think. This is the world's messiest application, but this is the last one. It's extremely patchy, like a lot more patchy than the last one. But I'm sure once you do one or two coats of it, it won't be nearly as bad. Um, but yeah, these are all uh, really pretty. They're really comfortable on the lips. <laughs> I'm making a mess. Um, they're really very comfortable to wear very blendable um yeah i don't really know what else to say about these um i don't i have not wore them so i can't talk about the longevity of these darker shades but i know the lighter shades really last like a long time um i did have to apply it after i ate because the day that i wore the one like all day i did have like a burger or something so it did take most of it off which wearing a bur eating a burger um with regular like lipstick and it's not a liquid lipstick you're kind of bound to end up taking most of it off. Um, that's just usually how it goes, um, unless you have a really, really good lipstick. But yeah, I'm gonna get off here. I gotta head to work. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I will leave the link for the um, lipsticks down in the description box, as well as a code for 20% off. And I think that's it for this video. I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.